When it comes to aquatics, there's a lot to see and discover. While there's so much going on up here, the waters are hiding some unbelievable inhabitants. Aside from regular fish, our oceans are home to some massive predators. In the deep sea, we encounter giants again, and when we hear the first sighting stories, we would even dismiss them as myths no more real than mermaids or the kraken. When blurry footages show up, we might call them conspiracies, like alien sightings. But scientists, ever curious, scientists sometimes go to great lengths to capture these animals, going up to 4,000 feet deep into the ocean in a submersible. In the cold November of 2007, far beneath the ocean's dark surface, where secrets dwell and shadows dance, a deep-sea robot ventures into the unknown. Its lights pierce the gloom, revealing a world both strange and mysterious. As it silently glides through the water, its cameras capture a sight beyond belief, a strange creature like a squid with long, ghostly tentacles drifting in the abyss. As the robot delves deeper, its gadgets flicker in the creature's eerie presence, as if it disrupts reality itself. Each tentacle moves with a hypnotic sway, seemingly enticing the robot to draw nearer. It's as if the creature guards ancient secrets, too terrifying for human minds to grasp, lurking in the depths. This mysterious creature with its long arms was spotted 2,386 meters below the surface, near an oil drilling site in the Gulf of Mexico. The footage, though blurry, is mesmerizing. The creature's translucent body glows in the robot's lights, its movements deliberate as if it senses the intrusion into its world. In another bone-chilling scene from 2019, as Ocean X uploads footage showcasing a monstrous deep-sea shark. The footage is jaw-dropping, capturing a large unidentified shark feeding on presumed bait. As the shark circles the submersible, a chilling moment occurs when its massive eye stares up at the divers, illuminated by a red light, sending shivers down their spines. Identified as a female, the shark's size is estimated to surpass that of the sub itself. The shark is actually something of a marvel. Unlike its more evolved relatives, which have five gills, the six gills, or six gills are more primitive a relic of the early Jurassic when the shark's ancestors first evolved. We've all seen squids, which are usually about two feet long, maybe three, but in the deep sea, we encounter the giant squid, which can get to about a whopping 43 feet long. But that's not even the biggest giant on the ocean floor. In this deep sea, the phrase survival of the fittest takes on a whole new meaning. There's a rule about the size of animals increasing as temperature decreases. It's called Bergman's Rule, and this is most evident in the phenomenon of deep-sea gigantism. The deeper you go in the sea, the bigger the animals get. So, deep-sea animal species tend to be larger than their shallower water counterparts throughout a wide taxonomic range. For example, the lion's mane jellyfish has recorded tentacles of up to 120 feet. There have been encounters with a 7-meter-long oarfish, 4-meter-wide spider crabs, and a 661-pound stingray. Apart from Bergman's rule, another theory by the biologist Max Kleber is that larger animals conserve energy more efficiently, which is very important for deep-sea creatures due to the limited resources available. He hypothesized that an organism's basal metabolic rate has a three-quarter ratio to an organism's mass, and having a larger body size is actually more beneficial as it uses up less energy overall. A creature with a large mass would comparatively have a slower metabolic rate than a smaller creature, and thus conserve more energy. These creatures will continue to fascinate scientists and researchers who keep finding out new information about them. Well, let's get back to this colossal creature. But what exactly is it? Indeed, this ominous being is identified as a big fin squid. Big fin squids are a rare type of cephalopod found in the oceans of the world, ranging from the Atlantic to the Pacific. They are known for their massive cylindrical body, large fins, and spindly appendages. The largest known squid is 21 feet long, with arms and tentacles 20 feet long. Currently, only three species have been described, Magna Pinna Atlantica, Magna Pinna Pacifica, and Magna Pinna Talismani. They have two tentacles and eight limbs, similar to a daddy long leg spider, and they use their tentacles and arms to create a spider web. 
There have been very few known encounters with these strange squids. There have been about 20 recordings in years. They live at extreme depths, which makes it quite challenging to explore and learn about them. In fact, scientists have not been able to find out how long they can live and how they reproduce. They have never even been seen consuming food. Although sightings have been incredibly rare, the clearest image of the big fin squid was filmed by a submersible in March 2021, which recorded a juvenile big fin squid at more than 20,000 feet deep. This marked the deepest observatory of the Magna Pinna ever. Now, the big fin squid isn't the only giant squid around. Meet what we like to call its distant and, well, bigger cousin. No discussion of deep sea giants would be complete without addressing the legends of the Kraken and its real-life counterpart, the giant squid. For centuries, sailors' tales of the Kraken, a monstrous sea creature capable of dragging ships into the depths, have captivated the human imagination. These legends likely originated from sightings of the giant squid, a real and formidable denizen of the deep. The giant squid, Architeuthis ducks, is one of the largest invertebrates on Earth, with specimens measuring up to 13 meters in length. These colossal cephalopods possess massive eyes, the largest in the animal kingdom, which help them see in the dim light of the deep ocean. The giant squid's long tentacles are equipped with powerful suckers and sharp hooks, adaptations that allow it to grasp and subdue prey. The largest known giant squid ever recorded was an astonishing 43 feet long, discovered off the coast of New Zealand. This massive creature, found in 2007, weighed nearly 500 kilograms, that's over a thousand pounds, and was captured by a fishing vessel in the icy waters of the Ross Sea. The sight of such an immense animal with its sprawling tentacles and enormous eyes stunned the crew and sparked a flurry of scientific interest and public fascination. These elusive giants, seldom seen by human eyes, continue to fuel the mythology of sea monsters and the allure of the ocean's hidden depths. Deep sea gigantism isn't limited to temperate or tropical waters. It also occurs in the frigid polar regions, a phenomenon known as polar gigantism. This intriguing subset of gigantism is believed to result from the unique conditions of polar oceans. The oxygen temperature hypothesis suggests that the combination of low metabolic rates driven by cold temperatures and high oxygen availability allows polar creatures to grow to substantial sizes. Creatures in this ecosystem often grow and mature very slowly, such as the Greenland shark, Somniosus microcephalus. This slow-moving shark can grow to be 24 feet, that's 7.3 meters long, and can weigh up to 1.4 metric tons, but that growth is spread out over a lifespan that extends for centuries. Greenland sharks grow approximately 0.4 inches, 1 centimeter, per year and they don't reach sexual maturity until they're around 150 years old. It's due in part to a lack of predators in the deep sea that these sharks can live so long and grow so large. In the icy waters of Antarctica, scientists have begun to uncover a host of unique and often gigantic species. Some of the fascinating giants of the polar deep include the giant Antarctic sea spider, Patagonian toothfish, barrel sponge, and the wondrous invertebrate predator known as the giant phantom jellyfish that has had only about a hundred sightings in the last century. A mesmerizing organism named after the river of the underworld in Greek mythology. The giant phantom jellyfish boasts long flowing tentacles and a translucent ghostly bell, making it a striking inhabitant of the southern ocean. This jellyfish, along with other polar giants, provides valuable insights into how extreme environments shape the evolution of life. Why are there even creatures this massive, you may ask? Art Woods, an ecophysiologist who has studied Arctic gigantism and is a professor at the University of Montana in Missoula, stated in an interview that because the ample oxygen supply significantly outpaces the animal's oxygen requirement, growth limits may be eliminated. Their surroundings allows them to develop larger body size and tissue size without suffering oxygen deprivation, he stated. While a plentiful supply of oxygen does not necessarily cause aquatic creatures to become large, it does allow for it.